The mostly arid region of Namibia, formerly a German colony known as Southwest Africa, is a country roughly half the size of Alaska with just over two million inhabitants. The bustling capital city of Windhoek is the port of entry for most hunters headed to the country's vast open lands for safari. I've read so much about Africa ever since I was very young. It's always been uh, full of wonder to me. And so it was for Benelli's Jason Evans, who was looking to test the R1 semi-automatic rifle while hunting springbok. Well, the Africa uh, trip was, of course, something we'd, I'd wanted to do for a long time. Guiding Evans was a professional hunter, Hartmut Fryer, a veteran of countless safaris for both plains game and dangerous game. There are two different uh, ways of hunting. You can hunt in conservancy areas or you can hunt on farmland where cattle ranching is uh, conducted as well. It's open, free-ranging game, but it is on uh, fenced farms for cattle. From the beginning, it was easy to see why Namibia has become such a popular destination for Americans looking to fulfill their dreams of enjoying a world-class safari. Every direction one looked, game could be seen in abundance. Gimsbach, Hartebeest, Kudu, Eland, and many other plains game animals inhabit the stretch of Namibia. It is a view not unlike what legendary Scottish explorer Dr. David Livingston must have seen as he journeyed through southern Africa in the mid-1800s. This time it was my turn to put the R1 to the test. Kudu, Kudu makes it, I don't know, a special animal to Namibia as well. Their appearance going through the bush, they're, they're disappearing in the bush, they just you saw them and he's gone. Big bull there. That's why they called him the gray ghost of the bush as well. And you never find him again. That makes him somehow special. Not long into our stock, Fryer spotted a small band of kudu, including a handsome bull half hidden in cover. Even though the animal spooked, we decided to follow the tracks to see if we could get back on the bull, knowing full well that it was one worth taking. Once a big game animal is aware that it's being pursued, however, its heightened sense of awareness makes it extremely difficult to approach. Despite the odds, after several hours of stalking, we managed to catch up to the bull once again. My challenge now was keeping my breathing under control to make a clean shot. That's it. That's it. Then I just had to convince my heart to settle down as well. Wait, 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 wait. Go. 
This is a heavy, nice, nice cooler. It's beautiful, right? Oh, it's beautiful. Look how heavy he is. Up to his tips of the horse. Can you believe it? Okay, what was that? <laughs> Got the adrenaline going a little bit after the first shot. <laughs> oh, yeah. Size of him. Taking out of the grass, oh. the horns there. Yeah. He's huge. Huge. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at the size of the spread. Aye, aye. What we got here? Oh. Stone dead, good Look shot. Oh. And look at this animal. Oh, the mass. Yeah. Yeah, and even even them show these these rings, uh, the socks start yeah. making socks. Looks like he's Although still it's not that that prominent on a kudu like yeah. it is on Springbok or Gamespot, right, but, yeah. but still they do the same and heavy. Yeah. Grab around it, they feel yeah, this. Yeah. You just feel that mass actually. Yeah. Yeah, That's amazing. This is a nice kudu. Yeah. Yeah. The nose here. Look at this hump here on that nose. Same uh -huh. like on the Springbok. Uh huh. And they have this hump here. That's yeah. mature. That's old. Oh, the mass on that. Oh, Thank you very oh, much. My, you're welcome. Dream you're come welcome, true. Really. Dream come true. <laughs> wow. Yeah. It's nice on a morning drive like that. Like you said, you always see these horns going yeah. through the bush, even yeah. if they're not there. That's right. Yeah. Now we found one. I saw a lot of those. <laughs> <laughs> Kudu bushes. <laughs> and does, now the, he, does he make up for your expect, expectations? Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs>